Welcome back to Cities Skylines. Ooh, we are having a few people dying now, but that's okay. It's okay. We built the cemetery at the end of last episode, so we should be- Ooh, all ten are in use. Uh, we should be good. Uh, now, I have, I think, changed some mods. I got like a newer prop anarchy mod. Uh, that, oh, wait, this is a different thing, sorry. I don't know why I just clicked it. I also got the, uh, the brush, uh, the forest brush thing, so we can do stuff like that. Uh, because so, that was another recommended mod that I should get. Uh, yeah, so this stuff, which I think, nope, not that, what am I doing? Which I believe, oh yeah, so this also includes a prop line tool stuff, which is good. So this means we could use stuff like fences, oh, not like that, <laughs> fences to, uh, start, I guess, building more easily with certain things. So yeah, that's good. Uh, but we have a lot of residential demand. And in the last episode, we also bought this tile here. So I guess what I want to do, I was talking about having like some sort of main road along the waterfront here. So I think we'll do that. Ooh, we could do a tram road. I'm not sure what kind of road I want it to be, to be perfectly honest. I would like... I kind of wish we had a four-lane road that was still this wide that didn't have a median in it. I'm sure it exists on the workshop, uh, and I'll probably have to get it, because that would be nice. It just, I don't know, I, the median looks so harsh to me to have that sort of running along the, the, the waterfront here like this. I don't know, it just seems, it's, it's too much. So maybe we use a road, right? Bear with me here. <laughs> We're going to use a road. Um, I have an idea. This may or may not work. I'm not sure which road I want to use. That's why I'm scrolling at the moment. Uh, I wonder, should we use a highway? Or is that a bit weird? Yeah, that looks terrible. Let's not do that. Let's use either... I'm trying to debate between using like a small road or... No, no, no. Okay. Okay. Right. Sorry. Let me explain what I'm going to do. So I'm going to build... This road, oh yeah, I also got the Network Multi-Tool, which is a recommended one. This can do a lot of crazy things, uh, which I'm sure we'll discover throughout the series. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to use... Okay, so I'm also keeping in mind that I'm using some of the space as like a park. So I'm not going to build right up on the edge. I'm going to be sort of back here somewhere, okay? And this road's just going to run along here. And I think come around... Actually, you know what? I don't know, actually know if I'm leaving enough room. Because here's what I'm going to do. I'll show you. So with the network multi-tool. So I have this parallel roads mod. It's kind of glitchy. It, it's good. It was the, the old school one. But this has a parallel roads tool in it. So you click here, click here. And then, boom. We just sort of set where we want the road to be, how far away we want it to be. Obviously, as long as we want the road to be. And then hit enter. And it builds. So I was thinking we could build a road like this along the foreshore. Instead of having like this one with a hard median in it. We have like this grass in the middle. We could do trees. Now of course I could. You might be saying I could just use, uh, you know, one of these. Oh wait, I actually don't have the road with grass in the middle. Okay, well I couldn't use it. But there is a road with grass in the middle. Uh, you know what, I'm actually going to pause the game just because there's a lot of demand that I'm not meeting right now. Um... Anyway, I'm going to redo this. So, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. This, again, this may change at some point, but I kind of like the idea of it. So, I'm actually just going to build a few straight sections of it. So, maybe a bit there, a bit there, and then I'm going to connect them together. Um, just because, I don't know, I feel like, I feel like it's a good idea. All right, let's flip that around. And then, so this road, yeah, it's going to come around this sort of uh, little mountain thing here. So, I think we'll come down this way a little bit, and then... You know, we'll come down further. And then, you know, oh, you know what? Oh, I'm going to use more network multi-tool. Not that I need to, but I want to. <laughs> I don't need to, but what we're going to do is so it's, it can do all this crazy stuff. Uh, I'm basically going to be using it for stuff I don't need to right now because I'm just excited to use it. So what we can do as well, there's cr the create curve or this one, which is create connection. So I, I, we could probably use a curve one, but let's use this. So at the moment, it's on the wrong side, which I think we can flip it. Yeah, there we go. So you do it like this and like is creating a, a curve or like with multiple and you can like adjust the radius of the curve and like, I don't know, this this mod is nuts. Sure, I could have just done this very easily with the road tool, but oh, okay, I thought I built it. Okay, well, I'm going to use the road tool. Uh, <laughs> hey, look, I'm, I'm still learning. Okay, 
This is this is what I'm thinking. I like this. Uh, I don't, I'm not sure how far down I'm going to go this way. I'm gonna. I guess I'll for now. Uh, I'll go down to this point. We'll have to build the ends of the roads as well in a second. I don't want it to curve too much. Yeah, I kind of want it to be not like super precise or anything like that. Just pretty chill. So we're going to use our little parallel tool, which I believe I should be able to select that and then that this one, right? Oh, okay. I'm on the wrong tool. <laughs> I thought I clicked on the parallel one. I did not. That's why I was a little confused. Anyway, uh, oh, no, I guess I'm I'm going too like too far down the road. I think maybe I'm a little confused. All right, there we go. So now we sort of just choose how far apart we want it to be, which I'm not actually sure. Like how wide, because the thing is, if we leave more room, there's all this potential. Like we could turn the middle of this into a tramway, for example, if we leave enough room. We could turn the middle of it into just a pathway. We could turn the middle of it into, you know, th there's so much potential if we leave enough space in between. So I'm inclined to actually leave quite a gap. Because uh, the other thing, we could just remove this road entirely and put a larger road in, you know? So I think there's a lot of potential here. Now, what else can we do? We can invert the network. What does that do? Control tab. Okay, I did it. I don't know if it means like it will be facing the other way, potentially. Uh, 20,000 bucks, hit enter. Did it build? It didn't. Okay. Uh, enter. Okay, this is not working and I have no idea why. It was working perfectly before. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, I, I just changed it all from a one-way road to a two-way road, then it worked. So maybe it doesn't work with one-way roads for some reason. That definitely seems like a bug. Anyway, um, now that I've got that working, <laughs> So yeah, I'm going to basically turn this all back into one-way roads, I guess. Oh, this is like off the ground over here for some reason, so let's just check that down. Yeah, so this is going to be our waterfront road, which I am pretty stoked for. I reckon this is going to be awesome. So this is going to run all the way down here. And I guess for now... Ooh, you know what? We, network multi... Oh wait, it might not work, considering it's been a little bit uh, messed up. So if we say here to here... What the heck is this? Uh, click on no to change... I mean, can we make it a little bit nicer? Oh, it says create curve. I thought it, I thought it would be nicer than that. <laughs> okay, maybe this way. All right, I'm gonna stop trying to use the, the, this tool for when I don't really need to, because it's really not working for me. <laughs> I just use normal, normal road tools. So at the moment, it's just gonna do a U-turn at the end, and I guess same down here, and then we'll expand it as we. You know what? I'm just gonna do a straight. It's gonna be easier. I don't know why I'm trying to overcomplicate things. Right. So what we're gonna do? This road is going to come straight to here and it's going to go straight through. Okay, so now what we're going to do is figure out how this is going to work. Uh, this, I, because mm. this is two intersections now. In an ideal world, this would technically be one intersection. And I guess this is, herein lies the problem with, uh, with doing this. <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do, that's going to turn left. So you, if you want to go straight, you have to go in that lane. I guess this little section here should just be smaller, right? It should be a maybe three. Oh, I don't have the road yet. There's an asymmetrical road for mass transit. Okay, fine. I'll leave it like that for now. All right, whatever. You know what? We'll come back to that when we <laughs> when we have more options. All right, so I'm just going to connect up some of these roads. Uh, now these are not. I don't think I'm going to go all the way through. You know, what? actually, this one will go through. So this one's going to go through like that. So that can connect through, this one won't. Uh, and then that will allow us to sort of just fill in some of this area here. Like so I'm not sure what's going on here. I know I wanted to change that. So let's just change this up a little bit. Oops, that was supposed to curve a little bit, yeah. Maybe to there, that can get, come along. And then that can sort of come around like so. That's better. And then that can come in to here. This one won't go all the way through. I think we'll sort of leave that one. And then I'm thinking maybe if we get like a little road through here and this will go, I think it probably shouldn't join. No, maybe this will be just a small road that doesn't go anywhere. So we'll just do that. And then we'll have another little back road there. Cool, that's good. And then through this section, I think we can probably fit a road maybe back through here. Yeah, that's good. So we sort of fill in a lot of this area. That's a bit empty in the middle, but that's good. All right, so let's go ahead and fill out this zone. And then we might want to work on... Uh, I feel like my pipes have started to fall apart, haven't they? 
<laughs> and then we're gonna work on maybe the waterfront area. Because uh, the whole point of having this big road down the front here is so that we can utilize it to make some cool looking stuff. And some cool parks and stuff along the waterfront. And they have like a nice public beach and stuff. Like I think there's a lot of potential for it. Alright, so... I don't know, like, I'm not going to zone on this side of the road. We might zone, like, commercial on this side, maybe. But we'll see how we go. So this, I guess I'm just going to fill it in, right? Because, yeah, it's just residential through here. We need a lot more anyway. We've got a fire station, a little bit of a plaza area here. Mm, I might actually do more shops here, so it's a little bit more of a shopping district. Won't go all the way back to the four tiles. I'll just do the three. And then this side's going to be the residential. Yeah, that works. That works for me. And then I guess just residential through here as well. And what I'm going to need to do as well, I need to go onto these roads and make them faster because at the moment they're going to be, what, 40 kilometers an hour? Pretty pathetic. <laughs> Pretty pathetic for like if there's going to be like a main road along our waterfront. Uh, we'll also probably need some more U-turns and stuff in through it. But I think all that intersection stuff is going to require a little bit more finesse to get that sort of where I want it. So we'll, we'll sort of visit that when it's time. All right, so let's just fill in a lot of this because we, we've still got a huge demand for residential. So I just kind of want to fill in a lot of this space. And then we probably need to look at services that are in this area as well. So I'm going to leave this main road of any residential because I don't want residential there. Uh, we could probably do some here as well, just a little bit. And that's looking pretty good. This little expansion down here. And then... I guess commercial, let's do some of that. I don't know how, like if I, if I do want it this close, all this stuff, I guess so. So we'll just do that. Now I'm wondering if I, not natural disasters. So I don't know if we should have crossings all along this road. Like, cause we've got the crossing here that will get you obviously to the middle. Uh, and there's no point in having it there unless we also do footpaths and stuff, which I guess would make sense. So maybe we look into that. Okie dokie. So now public transport wise, we did do the little bus line. It kind of doesn't do a whole lot at the moment. You know, it's kind of hanging out. Oh, this is having power troubles because not everything's connected. Guys, come on. Seriously? If you just sort of work together here, it'd be fine. Um, yeah, so... Oh, this is looking good. This is looking good. I like this road. This is going to be a really cool park area. Now, I think we... So we, we could do maybe a nature reserve. Hang on. I did download some paths, actually. Well, a path, maybe. So this, which I think is a smaller path, because that's actually what I wanted to do. Oh, it's very, like... Hmm, I was hoping it kind of blended more in with the terrain. Because So I wanted a thinner path, because, like, the, the game paths are, like, look how big they are. Like, they're huge. So I wanted some smaller ones. So if you guys know of any other smaller ones, let me know. I mean, this one will be good. I guess it, it might actually be good for this area because it's a little bit more, uh, I guess, almost formal in a way. Like you could have like this sort of coming up and down here, just like a little, little, little fun, you know. Might even be too small for this area, but you know, that's kind of what I want to do, I think. So why don't we get, I'm going to create a park area, which is here. Oh, I already did. Great. So this is actually going to extend to the middle of the road as well, I think, because we're going to have stuff there too, whether it's just pathways or whatever. But I guess the main entrance of the park will be on the beach side. So I guess, I don't know how much of this, I don't think I want to build like houses and stuff here, so I think this will be all part of the park, like a nature reserve or something, or something along those lines. So we'll do something like that. I guess we'll just, might as well do that. Dean Hill, what a dumb name. Should it be like Dean Beach or something? Oh, whoops. There you go, Dean Beach. <laughs> Alright, so we got that. Now we do have a few... Do we have like some piers and stuff, which is good? But this could... Must have... Oh, we have a main gate. All right, okay. We should get a large main gate. Should we get it like... Oh, space already occupied. Guess where do we want to do it? I guess we should get some... Well, I don't have any parking yet, but we should do like a little... Kind of like what we did with the school, where we had like a little zone where you sort of pull in. Hang on, turn off snapping, but have grid snapping because I want to build along here. So I'll have like a little section here where you sort of pull in. And this is where you sort of drop off, you know? 
or park or what, whatever we're doing with it, you know? Yeah, that's better. <laughs> okay. So now I want to turn off these little foot crossings here. I don't want them crossing there because they can cross there or here. You know, that's fine. Um, okay, cool. Now we get the park main gate, which is this guy. Uh, oh, and that does not place in the center, which is just great. So I'm going to slide it over. So we have like, there's like a little bit of parking on this road and there's also parking in the actual park. And then you sort of come in here. I think that's great. Now let's get some water out here. How do I want to do this? I guess I just follow that road there. Does that count? Hey, there you go. Great, so that'll be there. And then this will allow us to do now these kind of things. So which was, what's this? The park pier, which I guess maybe we can get it down there. We've also got the park pier one. Maybe we'll get another one down this end of the beach somewhere. Obviously, we'll have to connect these up. Now, aren't there like restaurant piers and stuff? I think that's in here. So we can get those soon too, which would be nice. But yeah, so now I guess we just sort of connect that up. Now, do we have a pathway that is going to be suitable? What does this one look like? Well, you don't need to level out the entire beach for it. <laughs> uh, I think we want these ones probably in the nature reserve path. Even this seems to level out the, the thing. Oh, actually, I wonder if we can we change that? Uh, the node controller. What if we just said slope? Can I like slope the whole section of this or? Not really. So has to, the whole path still has to be flat, which kind of doesn't look great, does it? <laughs> um, okay. Well, maybe I should use a small path then. Wait, what about these? What do the the vanilla gravel ones have to be flat? No, okay, so these ones, okay, you know what? We're gonna have to use these. That's fine, all right, let's go from, how do we wanna get there? I think we need to have a fancy pathway that runs along the foreshore. So this will, oh. We've got prop anarchy on. Okay. <laughs> That's all, okay, well, we still have that one there. That's all right. I think we're going to need a lot more like shrubbery and stuff along this this section here because I think it will look really cool. Have like sort of little overgrown areas. But this one can come up here somewhere. Not quite sure where it's going, but we'll go we'll go like that for now. Okay, that's good. And then same way, same sort of thing down this way. And then along this, we're going to have like I guess little things like maybe a plaza, a statue, you know, bits and bobs. And this will come up along the cliff. You know, cool. So that sort of gives us that pathway around there. Then all in here, we can sort of do some some more things as well. Now to get down here, I guess this is where we're gonna go for like a little dirt path or something. I don't know why these don't seem to move out of the way for the paths. Just interesting. It's all right. I mean, I'll just move it manually. That's fine. Just interesting. So something like that. All right, it needs power. That's fine. We'll get to that. Now for this one, uh, not I deal because we're gonna have to like you know go across the beach but I think potentially with surface painter yeah so we can just kind of make it disappear with surface painter so I think we could even just do it like that it comes to the beach and then you sort of they can still walk there but we're just not going to see it which I think makes a lot of sense so let's just do that unfortunately the power situation is a little more awkward uh we're not going to have these giant things on the beach so we're going to have to figure out a way to get that to connect so maybe we can just get some other attractions that provide power that's sort of nearby, you know? Like what if we had a restroom up on this pathway, for example, that's kind of around here. Is that close enough that it's gonna draw power? It is, so like, for example, that's good. This one, a little bit more complicated. I don't know that we're gonna be able to do anything on this one, maybe with a gazebo, like if we had like a gazebo up here somewhere, like in this section, is that? Oh, that is close enough. Then all we gotta do is have some sort of Thing here and over that side, you know, it's a it's a little bit of a balancing act, but it'll work. All right, let's get some more pathways. Actually, let's get some more park entrances because we got to figure out how this is gonna work. I guess we'll have them. Well, I guess one here. There's a road right there, so that makes sense to me. And maybe one here as well with that road. And then maybe I'm not sure where else. We'll just do those two for now. I guess one here is probably important by this main road too. So I'll put it there. Maybe over here, because that actually might connect with this. That might provide power through. 
So we'll see. Let's have a look. It does. So then if we had commercial here, that probably would power all the way through, which is fantastic. Great. So let's just work on connecting all this stuff up. And then we're going to be cooking. It's going to be great. So this I'm going to go, I guess just to there. That's fine. And then this one can go through here as well. Uh, Alt A, I think is prop anarchy. Yeah. So this should stop. Okay. Never mind. No, I was going to say it should stop removing stuff, but it looked like it removed something there and then put all this over here. So that seems like it was worse. Uh, <laughs> if anything. But yeah, that's all right. We'll just, uh, we'll just do it manually. You know, it's all good. <laughs> uh, it's all a learning curve again. Move this little rock, move this. It's all right. I kind of like the overgrown look anyway. I mean, as long as you can still look like it, you can walk along the path, it's fine. Yeah, that's, that's fine. All right, so that's connected there. Uh, and then this is going to come through. I guess right on that corner there is probably a good spot. And likewise with this one. I don't know what's going on with that curve. It kind of... What the heck? How did that happen? This kind of got messed up. But I'm not sure how, so... Anyway, we'll just move this all a little bit. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. That's fine. Cool. That's looking good. So now we've got all these gates connected up as well. Uh, then, so for here, for example, we're going to do like a little pathway that will connect across. Maybe this one could have trees. I don't have the mod that replaces trees on the little pathways yet. Um, oh, that looks dumb anyway. Let's not do that. We might as well just do our own trees, you know? So let's just put this... How? Yeah, it looks kind of weird, doesn't it? Should we do... Maybe it should just be a regular path. Just because that looked... I don't know. It looked kind of weird to me. Like, if we just did a regular path like this. Mm -hmm. And then we could do a crossing here. So node, there's a node right there, slightly in the wrong spot. If I do snapping, slide it along to here, right in front of that. Then node controller, turn that into a crossing. There you go. So now they can just walk straight across here easily. And that's already got a crossing, that's already got a crossing. This one doesn't, so we should probably work on this too. Is there people down here? I thought I saw someone. Okay, yeah, so then we do the same thing here. So we got, oh, that's actually really close. So let's just move this along. Actually, you know what? What if we... Hmm. Like, it's gonna... Oh no, that's alright. I was gonna say it might mess up the look of the road because it's like perfectly aligned. That's fine. Okay, right, that'll be a crossing. Good. And then get a little pathway straight to there. And then I guess we also have to do a crossing here. Which, again, the node is like nearly there. I guess I could have moved both these nodes in tandem. That would have been a good idea. All right, so that'll be crossing. So then they can walk straight across into the park. So this over here, let's get some commercial because we've got a bit of demand for commercial anyway. Let's get some along this section because then that should actually power all of this stuff down that way too. Uh, it looks like we also need some more workers. Is that educated or highly educated? Uh, just educated. So I think that's just either high school or something. Elementary is a little low. So let's get another elementary school, which is going to go... Hmm, I was like, maybe you could go on this main road. I don't know if I want an elementary school on like a big main road though, you know? So maybe we can do it over here somewhere. Maybe let's build out this section a little bit. So this is going to be this road here. Uh, I don't know if I like it curving that way, so I'm actually going to change that. This is going to go this way. Go straight a little bit. I'm going to come down. Go that way. That looks pretty good to me. And I'm going to get another road. That goes down to here. That's going to go all the way to right about there, just before it hits that, which I like. And then we're going to come off the side and have a road run along here. Nice. I like that. I like it. This is what I'm talking about. This is kind of the road. Uh, I don't know what I was going to say. This, this is the road to success. Yes, that is what it is. Uh, cool. <laughs> it's going to go there. And then we're going to have one little road, probably a little alleyway, maybe. One way with parking. I love these. I, lo I just, I don't know. There's something about the small roads I really like. Um, I don't want to remove the big parking there. So I'm going to say prioritize older roads. And I think this should leave zoning on both the other roads. So if I actually put this really close at the back here. Oh, that is that. Oh, except for that section for some reason. I say that is perfect. Almost. 
Okay, it's doing it there too. I don't know why. But yeah, I want this to have four tiles zoning and this to have none on this side, but have some there. Because I think that's kind of cool. You know? But it seems to be a little confused because it's breaking up my zoning. So I might have to... I need to... <laughs> Maybe I just need to like figure out how to mess around with this stuff more. Alright, so we're gonna get, this one's going to go all the way through as well. And then this can just connect. Come on. Come on. Come on. There you go. But obviously flip that section. Okay. So, uh, let's go prioritize... No, disable... Hang on. If I disable zoning... Wait, let me just... Dis disable... Wait, where did my... Oh, yeah. So if I just go through here... Uh, okay, that's not disabling zoning. I don't understand this mod, to be perfectly honest. Oh, wait, there it goes. Wait, what? <laughs> okay, right click is all I have to do. Let's just right click. Okay. Now let's say prioritize older roads. That's better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is what I want. So this is going to have zoning on this street. And this little laneway is only going to have zoning on this side here. So it's almost like a little alleyway at the back. That is sick. I don't know. I find this stuff so cool. <laughs> I find it very cool. And then we're going to have a little pathway. Uh, I am also aware that those guys don't have uh, water, so I will fix that. Now this pathway, I guess uh, it's kind of annoying not to line it up perfectly, so I will line it up perfectly. Well, I actually didn't mean to use that pathway. I meant to use this one. Uh, so this will go there. Come all the way through. And this will come through here. And then I would like this road to connect through as well, but maybe it should go this way. Though it does really seem like it could fit through here. Maybe we could use a really small one. Like, would this fit? It kind of does. Now, I don't know... What if I drag it? Is this going to destroy the zoning there? I don't think so. I don't actually know if this is, like, functional. Um, it's, distance is too short. And drag it... Oh, okay. Well... Destroyed half that building, so we might as well just use a bigger pathway. <laughs> I would love to get, just get some little laneways that sort of fit in here that it, that they can walk on that doesn't destroy half the stuff, you know? Okay, that's, that's all right, though. That's fine. All right, that's looking good. So this is a really nice... I, I really like this area, actually. I think that looks really cool. Let's get some pipes, because they need water. And we already have a building that was abandoned over there from... I guess, lack of workers, so... My bad, guys. Look, I'm working on it, okay? Look, there's a lot of... A lot of things on my plate right now, okay? And uh, these things, they take time, you know? Down Taylor Street, and I guess we'll go down Todd Street here. And that should cover all that stuff. And this actually has power now, too, which is great. So Dean Beach, which is a terrible name, by the way. Is, uh, is popping off with income, 50. So we've had five visitors, fantastic. All right, so let's get some more residential. Actually, let's have a look at services, because that's the other thing. And let me pause. I, I've been letting this game run. I really need to pause. Healthcare, we have plenty of availability here. That's fine. Uh, death care was not the same. So there's also elder care, which I don't even... What Do we even need this? Is this the thing we need? I don't know. Uh, cemetery is here. How's that going, by the way? Only two in use at the moment, so we're sort of settled down on that. Fire department, that's probably okay. We probably need more up here rather than like up here rather than down here. Police department's not great over here either, but you know, it's probably fine. Schooling is rough. We need the elementary school. So I think this looks like a nice little spot or somewhere like along this road or maybe even along Campbell. Actually, maybe Campbell is a good one because it's kind of like still connected to the main street. So it'd be accessible, quite easy to get to, but not like right there. Now, high school is fine, so let's not worry about that. So, um, pause. Is that enough? For now, at least? Yes, plenty. All right, fantastic. Now, parks and stuff. We, I know we do have that big physical park thing, but I think we need some smaller little ones. I'm going to get a dog park, and it's going to go on the corner of this road here. So I'm going to just do this. Shove it there a little bit more. I need the zoning to update a little bit here. Did that? Yeah, there we go. So that fix it. So we get a little park there. That should be fine. Uh, and then I think the rest of this, I'm just going to put some houses in. Or at least in the, all these little back areas. I do like the... Oh. 
So I do like this laneway, but it's just gone wrong again. Oh, uh, hang on. Dang it. There we go. Because I don't touch it. Hang on. Dang it, hang on. <laughs> There's a weird spot there. It's annoying me, but oh well, that's fine. Whatever. Yeah, so that's good. That's that's fine. We'll use that. Right, this is good, this is good. And then I think all of this main road is going to be commercial. At some point it'll be a mix of like offices as well, I'm sure, and maybe like high density residential. But I don't want any like little houses on this road, at least not in this section. Maybe we could do some here, but I kind of like it just being this big shopping strip. I guess I probably shouldn't all be- you know what? No, I'm going to change that. I was gonna say it shouldn't all be shopping. It's, some of it should be residential and it will be this. It'll be this section here. Because this could be like, it's could be pretty expensive housing. You're pretty close to the beach, you know, on the main road. That's pretty sweet. And I actually might do some here too. That's fine. All right. Now this road down the bottom. Let's have a look at this because I haven't done the speed limit on this. I think I would like to do it's 40 at the moment, which is a bit rough. This road's 50. If this is like a big main road. I feel like it should be 70 because it, it's like this sort of, this road that has a huge median in it. Like, lots of space for crossing, so I think it could probably be up to 70 kilometers an hour. With, like, you know, people crossing it and stuff. Probably, it'd probably be more realistically like 60, but, you know, it's city skyline, so whatever. I think 70 is good. Because it will probably encourage some people, if they're here, going over here, to, like, come down to this road, maybe. Oh, actually, they can't even do it. But you know what I mean. Like, later on, it'll make more sense. At the moment, I don't think we're going to have many people on it, because uh, it doesn't really go anywhere. But I think it's... I don't know, doesn't that look really cool? I think it looks really cool. I think it looks really cool. My mum says it's cool too, so, you know. <laughs> My mum thinks it's cool. Oh, oh, I was just saving. Gosh, I don't like when games freeze when they're saving. The school needs some power. We need some more public transport too. I, I, I'm going to do that in a second. All right, so we do need more commercial, which I think, again, will be along. I'll do it along. Actually, you know what? No, this is good. Like I said, I like the idea of some houses being along these main strips. Also, it shouldn't all be commercial everywhere, you know? Uh, so I think I like that. You know what? I'm going to do. Hmm, do I want to do anything on this side of the road? I don't. Hmm. You know what? I am. I'm going to do a little bit here because I wasn't actually sure if I wanted a zone on this side. But I'm going to do a little bit here, because this is sort of near this main town section, you know? Like, it's a little bit busier. They've got a few shops here, but I'm not going to do much more than that. Uh, I will do some... I don't know if I want it there either. I kind of want it a little bit more open. Hmm. I'm trying to see where I want to do more commercial. How's all this going out here, by the way? This this section here, this um, ore industry is really struggling. But as we have more demand for industry, that will probably fill out. So <laughs> it'll get there. But at the moment, it's kind of struggling. How's that little park doing down here? It's looking pretty good. It's a three-star park. You know, it's quite nice. I feel like there should also probably be a pathway through here. This park kind of just dumps you here. And there's like no way to get through. You know what? I'm going to do a little path. That Oh, that's a big building there. Gonna have to destroy some some livelihoods here. Do I want it perfectly in line, or do we just go where it fits? Probably where it fits. There you go. All right, then we're gonna need to do a node, which yeah, there's none here, so we're gonna do one just about there. Oh, it already made a crossing for me. Perfect. Yeah, so now they can come through the park, walk straight through. I think that's pretty good. Nice. Commercial demand is still a little bit there. Where do I want to put it? Because I don't want to fill out this road, especially not around here. It doesn't seem like there'd be stuff there. Maybe a bit more over this way, I guess, because we'll probably build up this area a bit more too, so we might as well. Get some more commercial down here. Guess we need some water pipes as well. Uh, I'll start from here. Let's come around. There you go. Good enough. Good enough, don't look at it. All right, and then I guess this is already all sort of zoned, but I'll do a little bit more zoning through here. All right, we probably need, so we got a little firehouse there. Yeah, that's right. Uh, probably need something else, but you know, <laughs> you know, our population is so small, it's not really worth it. All right, public transport, what else do we have? We got, so we got the buses, we have 
Trams. I don't know if I want to invest in doing trams yet. There's also boats and plane. We could build a whole airport right now. Probably not a good idea. I mean, I guess buses is the way to go. So at the moment, this bus kind of just stops here, which I don't know if that makes a whole lot of sense, but maybe we could use this as like a little bus, almost like a bus hub. Obviously not really, but for now, like this could be a little place where you could change lines, you know? We could start here and then it would sort of go down this way. Uh-oh. Powers. I don't think we have enough power anymore. So we have two coal plants. Oh, when do we get other? I don't want coal anymore. All right, so we get oil at 4,600. Hydro. Oh, when do we get something good, like, like green energy? Like, I know we have these, but, you know, we're going to go coal. Let's plonk another coal down. There you go. All right, that'll be enough. <laughs> that should be enough. All right, back to the bus line. So this is here. And then, okay, so then we'll come... Oh, it'd be good to like stop at the park at the main entrance. Uh, but oh, I guess I guess we will. Hang on. So if we wait, where is where am I even going with this bus line? That's probably what I should figure out first. I don't really know. It's kind of awkward. So I want to get something over here. Maybe we need one that sort of sort of runs along at the moment. It doesn't. The thing is, because this doesn't really go anywhere yet, it, <laughs> it's kind of hard to get a bus line that makes sense. I guess it just has to be a shorter bus line, doesn't it? Just It just has to... Let's go here. We'll go along to the little elementary school. That makes sense to me. We'll come down here. Come down along to the main section here, along the front. Uh, oh, there's no easy way to turn around. I need to do a little turnaround. Let's do like a little U-turning section here. Should I do it here where that road is? Because then what we could do... Is we could have a little, ro uh, little pathway. Later, for, for later on, so that it extends there, so these people can like walk through, so. Anyway, so that would be like a place where we can come back around, so we could use our bus, that is here. Hang on. There, and I guess we'll stop here as well. And I'll come around, maybe stop at the park. I mean, it's kind of weird because you stop right there as well, but whatever. So stop here on the way back, and then just sort of follow it back through. Um, I might stop a little bit further along because I don't want to stop at that same spot. And then this one's going to actually run up through here a little bit. And maybe just come back around. It's a little bit more varied. It's kind of strange. You know, like the way it goes because it's kind of like... It, it does it like a big U. It almost should be a loop, but... I don't know, we're sort of going like this and then coming back. It, it, it's a bit, it, look, it is strange. I'll, I will admit, I will admit. All right, these buses can be, let's go maybe like a pale yellow. Ew, that's going to be gross, isn't it? <laughs> I guess it'll just be a regular bus. I don't know how many we need. Maybe six, is that six? Yeah. How's the other bus, bus line going, by the way? Is that, um, is that popping off? How do I, oh, there we go. 217, 145. Okay, well, we either need more vehicles or bigger vehicles. I'm inclined to say bigger vehicles, which we should have the double, there's a double decker bus or we have the bendy bus. So let's maybe go super bendy. That holds a hundred. Okay. So, oh. oh, dang it. Hang on. Uh, five. Oh, that's seven. Hang on. Okay. Yeah. Super bendy bus for that line. This line has regular buses. Where is the bus depot anyway? Is that up here somewhere? Oh yeah, here it is. So we got these buses here, which I believe are these, these must be new, right? I don't know, I don't remember. Oh my gosh, it is super bendy. It's got three sections, jeez. Is there like a regular bendy that isn't super too, that kind of seems too bendy. Oh well, especially for this little town. <laughs> Actually, speaking of little town, how's our traffic situation going? It's a bit red here. I don't know. I guess it doesn't really need to be red, but it's just kind of saying it is. I would say continue, continuous flow through. I guess it slows down because it goes from 100 to 50. So that's probably, maybe that's why that's red. Uh, control S, stay in lane. There we go. Hey! <laughs> and there too, please. There you go, stay in lane through there. It's all right, works fine. I mean, we don't really have any traffic issues right now, so not to worry. It is, it is coming along though. This place is looking good. Oh my gosh, we got a lot of residential demand still. People really want to move into West Valley, which by the way, there was a suggestion to name it after my dog Bowser. 
Uh, we could go Bowserville, or is it Bowser Town or something? Bow Bowser's Bowserville. Hmm. I feel like I could come up with something better, but it's going to be called Bowserville for now. <laughs> I feel like there's a better way to incorporate his name. How's that park going? Is anyone walking down this little- Oh, yes! Yes, it's working! Yeah! See, they walk down this pathway that's invisible, but it is there, so they can still get down here, which is great. Um, okay, I think we should do more things on this park as well. So I think, similar to what we did with our other one, um, we could do, like, the little cafe... Actually, this one could actually use an info booth. That might be a good idea. Let's do a little info booth, maybe... Maybe here on this... this. Hmm, well, if this is the main entrance, it should be around here somewhere, shouldn't it? Right, let's put it there. And then let's do some public restrooms around the place. That's probably a good idea. Didn't we do some over here? There's some there, that's good. Maybe do some over here. And then, like, down here as well. Because that should get power from over there. And then we could do, like, the little cafe. Like, this could actually be on this sort of road. I kind of like the idea of that. You know, sort of accessible there. You know, there's a few extra little things there. That should be good. So that should make this park a little bit better and a little bit more attractive, at least. You know, come check out the, the sweet river or bay. It's nice. I think it looks good. Um, all right, so residential. Uh, I guess we should just expand... Kind of, it looks kind of weird at the moment that we've got this big main road, nothing here. I don't really want to expand like a huge block here. I kind of like the idea of spreading out to the side a bit more. So I think what I might try and do is try and almost make it look like a little... Oh no, how's this going to work? Oh, that actually kind of semi-worked how I want it to. But not quite. There's kind of something weird going on here. Is there like... Hmm, just a weird... Like, I don't know what's going on in this little corner here. Is it because we got like crossings banned? Yeah. Oh, even with it on, it's still kind of weird, isn't it? I don't know what's going on with that. Um, I guess I should make sure that our lanes... You cannot turn that way. You cannot turn that way. This can only go left. This can only go left. Don't think I need to the others, it should be fine. So they still can't like drive straight across this road, so... If they want to sort of go across, they use this one down here. Okay, so then this... Yeah, so I don't want this to be a big block expanding, expanding out, so I'm just going to do like a little bit that maybe goes to about here. This road sort of follows up to there. And then maybe has like a little section back here somewhere that we could later fill in. But it doesn't quite, you know, sort of do too much that way at the moment. And then we sort of maybe expand on this section a bit more. Okay, oh. Uh, cut that way. And then this. Oh. The curves are kind of sometimes weird when you just do a straight section. It kind of gets confused, I think. How do I want to do this? Because we're going around the corner. I, I don't know if I want to... Because we'll, I think this road... Okay, hang on. I, I, it gets a little interesting here. Because I think I want to do a bridge here. Um, and how I want to do that bridge, I'm not sure. What does this bridge look like, actually? It's like a... Oh, does this not have... Oh, they don't have a race section. Okay, never mind. <laughs> it didn't come with one. That's fine. Oh, wait, no, I'm stuck on the ground. Hang on, they might have one. Oh, it does. What does it look like? Oh, it's just that. Okay, that's fine. All right, uh, we either do a single bridge, like just build out of a road like this, or we'd use... Do these have anything interesting? No. They kind of want a cool-looking bridge, you know? You might have to download some custom bridges. I could use like this. <laughs> uh, I have a couple of truck. You know what? I can't. You know, I kind of like it. There's like the old truss bridge or something, and then we'd like upgrade it later on or something. <laughs> I, I don't know. I kind of like it. You know what? I'm gonna do this, and then I think we'll it'll change. And I want all the sections to be the same size, so maybe if we do two section bridge like that. And then what we're gonna do... Oh, no, move it. Oh, here we go. It's like like this, yeah, yeah. Let's just raise that up. So it's gonna be a little higher up, so maybe about... Maybe about there. I feel like the middle is a little too high. Like it's... It should go up a little bit, but not too much. Something like that. Now... Actually, I'm just gonna do a regular road, and then I'm gonna use... That parallel thing in a little section. Alright, let's... 
gonna have to pull back some of those because it's not quite lining up with where that is. All right, so what we're gonna do, I don't know if this is gonna look good. No, oh, actually, I need this road to continue, but it also needs to go there. So we need like an intersection here, but how am I gonna... Oh, this is... Okay, when using multiple roads like this, it's gonna get complicated, isn't it? Okay, uh, we need to do something that is gonna work somehow. Uh, <laughs> Okay, well, let me just do this for now, okay? Easy. Simple. Then it also needs to have a road that comes around, and there needs to be an intersection. <sighs> yeah, this just became infinitely more complicated to do a custom intersection for this road. Maybe we need to not do it this way. I think it's because the problem is we'd end up with a road that's like this, so if we did an intersection on this road, so it'd be like this, right? If the two roads like this, then we need it to turn this way. You'd have to have the roads coming through like this. And then somehow <laughs> you almost end up with like a roundabout in the middle and it goes up that way and it's... It's too much. It's too much. Uh, so... We either just do a single bridge, which I think is probably a better option. What, oh, wait, what does this one look like? Hang on a second. Oh, no, 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 tunnel. Oh. I like the... I like the little red truss bridge. I kind of like... Uh, you know, I like that. But maybe we just need to do something like this. But the road is so ugly. <laughs> maybe, maybe not. Maybe just this. You know what? I might, I might have to download some custom bridges, because that'll make this a lot better. All right, let's go... So this is going to have to be up higher, I think. I might actually need to level these a little bit. Just because it's all... Oh. So I said level to object height. Le level to object... Hello? Wait. I feel like it's not working. Um, let me try again. Level to object height. Ah, there we go. All right, so we're gonna have to do that, and then this will just have to connect individually. So this will go... I don't even know what's gonna be over the other side of this bridge yet. I'm just getting it built in now so we have it, you know? We come down to ground level. I don't know about there. That was a weird way to do that. I think this should probably be elevated. And then this road will just come past it and we'll sort of join it together. Okay, so this will go... Let's just build this road. Let's go normal. Like this somewhere. And around, so kind of like that. Actually, we're gonna have to do this because the parallel thing doesn't seem to like when I use one-way roads. So let's get out a little handy-dandy uh, pocket knife. All right, so this needs to go to there. Beautiful. And then obviously we need to turn that back into the one-way roads and I need to connect it. This little section. Uh, oh. Okay, so basically now, instead of having like a billion roads here, we just have this one that will just come through. Like that. So similar to what we have over there. We'll still have to figure out how this is all going to work. Um, and I think I'll probably customize all the, the lanes and stuff later on. For now, it's basically just going to have nothing. It, it just do whatever. Because we don't have that much traffic that it's a problem. Uh, and then that will just join that. Okay, so then that will allow this road to continue. Then we have a bridge. Again, I'll probably change this bridge at some point. So this is by no means anything final. Uh, so don't fret too much about that. Now, I'm wondering if I should continue, not this big road, but maybe a smaller road through here. And use this intersection. Or if we should split it out maybe further down here. Do you know what? Yeah, I'm going to do it further down here. I kind of, I wonder if we could do... Actually, the cool thing is we could even make like end up making like turning lanes that are made out of like a three lane variant. So we could do like it goes into three lanes and this one's like a turning lane that then peels off and goes around, you know. I feel like there's a lot of potential with building the road this way. Whether we'll ever fully realize it and it will work how I'm imagining it, I cannot say. But I feel like there's potential. And that's the most exciting thing about it. <laughs> okay, we need to get some more houses. Let's get some more houses in here. Uh, we need more residential. This is going to come through... No, it's going to go like this. This one's going to come straight through like that. 
And we're gonna have my little laneways. I don't know, am I overusing these laneways? Let me know. I'm not I'm not actually sure to be perfectly honest. Like, am I doing too many of these? Like, I really like them, but I don't know if I'm overdoing it, you know? I don't like the little one tile there though. That's a little rough. So maybe we use this to give us two on this road. Yeah. And then I'll just put it back to normal, otherwise I'll forget. Uh-oh. Why can't I go back to zero? Where's zero? Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so we get that two tiles on there. That's better, because then we're getting like two tile houses there. That's only one. I feel like it just changed. It was perfect before, but whatever. Uh, so these will be houses, I guess. Oh yeah, we definitely have like pathways through here. Seems like a prime spot. You know what? It seems like a prime spot for like a park or a statue or something. I feel like there's something that could go here. Where are those statues? They're in here. We got a statue of industry. That's too big. Um, statue of wealth. Mm, it's a bit pretentious. Statue, the Lazarette Plaza. Building the medical center. What was this? Plaza of death. Seems a little extreme. Uh, city arch. Could do a city arch. That's kind of fun. Or Bird and Bee Haven. That is fun. Let's, what about this rock? Meteorite Park. Can we get that in here? I feel like this is a good spot for it. I don't know why, but I feel, yeah, I feel like this is a spot for this, you know? I don't know why. But I feel like it is. Yeah. So you're sort of coming across this bridge and you're like, whoa, Meteorite Park, sweet! I've always wanted to come to here, to Bowserville to see Meteorite Park. Oh, we've got some garbage problems. Uh, that's exactly why we came here. It's like when you're driving around towns and you see like the big banana or something, you know, you're like, we, ca we came here to see Meteorite Park. And we finally got to see it, you know, I think that's pretty cool. These pipes are rough. Uh, now what's going on? Why, why have we lost power down here? Oh, I don't think we ever had power there actually, you know. Now, I feel like this area could have more stuff around it, like maybe here, but then again, I'm still not, maybe it should actually just be parks. I was going to do commercial, but I think maybe more just park stuff. We could do like a park info booth, maybe. Actually, let me do a side gate, because we're, we're like, you know what? I need to expand this area. Expand the park area a little bit to include this section, because then I can just move it more, no, move it more to this sort of corner where the intersection is. It kind of just makes more sense. It sort of lines up with everything. Yeah, so that goes there. That should now actually be powered. And then we can get the pathway and we can do like an info booth here or something. Maybe gazebos. I don't know. I feel like there's potential for stuff to be here. That also needs water. So I'm just going to do that. Don't worry about it. Uh, let's get out. Mm, the park plaza could also be good, couldn't it? Maybe, that's a, maybe it's a good spot around here to have the plaza. Like this could be like almost like a little built up kind of park area. Oh, actually, that's a bathroom right there. Um, info booth. Oh, yeah, let's go here. We got like a few things around here, you know. We got like the little plaza, info booth, the meteorite park. I don't know. I feel like this is, it kind of all sort of flows together, you know. I might do like a little path here. This is almost like maybe one of those uh, desire paths. Where lots of people just walked here so the grass doesn't grow anymore. So like people came across and like walked over to the plaza. I kind of like that idea. Uh, and then what else could we put in there? We did maybe another cafe could be good near the plaza. About there. I feel like I want another one of these trees. I just removed it. I feel like I like these. I kind of like the size of some of these trees. Oh, these are all really small, of course. You know, I like the. Oh. Hang on. Alt A. Prop Anarchy. What? It doesn't work. I don't understand. <laughs> sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Anyway, whatever. Yeah, I don't know. I kind of like that. There's a little a little bit of something going on down. Oh my lord. Okay, we gotta fix this garbage issue. <laughs> Wait, what happened? Oh my gosh. Okay, what's happened with my garbage? <laughs> oh, is it full? Is that what happened? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That that'll 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 cause it. Okay. Alright, let's get some recycling plants. Um I guess we should do them out of here somewhere. Maybe we can do like a little recycling center. They sort of come down here, you know. Come through the recycling area. 
And then it sort of turns into a dirt path for some reason. And then we have them like back here. I don't know. I just kind of like the, the story behind it. It's like a little recycling center. Hang on. We come out here. Well, it's not going to be little. I'm going to have to do a few of them. And I'll sort of come back around. Going back onto that road. And then we'll have like a separate exit sort of thing. Oops. Oops. Now we'll come down here. Almost want to put like a toll booth <laughs> on this entrance, you know? And then this will go from here, I guess, maybe. Yeah, like that. And then I guess this will be turned into also that. Cool. I don't know. Kind of fun. Unnecessary? Yeah, but uh, it kind of adds a little bit of story. I don't want any people crossing here. This seems really unnecessary. And traffic can flow freely through this. And then these guys... Oh, no, the... Oh. All right. These guys give way. Cool. Uh, yeah, so then down here... I don't know why, but I just kind of felt like this would be the case. Uh, this will be the recycling area. What I'm going to do, because I just realized I actually want to do it like this. Do a couple of roads so we could have a whole bunch of them sort of lined up. So the truck sort of picks the road that's, or the, the center that's best. It sort of like heads down there. There, there. Wait, actually, how many do we need? Let me see. Before I start putting a whole bunch in. Okay, that's not enough. Maybe four. Is four even enough? <laughs> the problem, yeah, the problem with the recycling is it's not as efficient as uh, the garbage dump. <laughs> so, a little rough. Is that enough to get water there? I guess I don't like, I actually want to change all this to one way because I don't like the way they're finding their way around here. There we go. All right, so what I'm going to do is change these to... Is it necessary? No. Oh, that should, that can still be dirt. Is it kind of cool? Yes. <laughs> That's all that matters. Yeah, so now they all sort of like flow out this way and go around and onto a dirt path. I don't know why some parts are, oh my gosh, see, look at this. This is why we need some good traffic flow through. Wait, 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 wait. let's have a look at the, <laughs> the traffic. Oh lord, <laughs> it is red. Yeah, we're going to have a lot of garbage trucks going through the city right now. All right, is that enough? Uh, it's kind of not. <laughs> it's kind of not enough. We actually kind of need more recycling. Um, well, let's build down this way. Because we don't have to all be up there. I like this idea, though, of having, like, this recycling center. And obviously, it would make a bit more sense when we get, like, the big actual complex. But for now, we have to build it out of this. So, you know, you work with what you got. How's that? That's better. Look at that. Beautiful. <laughs> I love this. I do love this little <laughs> setup though. It's funny. Cool. All right. That's our new waste center. I'm going to actually empty this, this garbage tip. I'm going to empty it. So they'll start taking all this basically to these guys. And then uh, we'll go from there. Oh my gosh. All the garbage trucks. They're like, okay, we're going to have to send out every single garbage truck we've got. The entire town is disgusting. <laughs> hey, busy town. We got a few more things. We got city planning policies, tourism, a lot of policies here. Some more roads, which is nice. Uh, we've got police headquarters, like the bigger police and uh, fire stations, the oil power plant, the hospital. Ooh, a lot more like piers and jetties and stuff, which could actually be good for the beach. We've got beach volleyball. Very nice. Weather radar. Oh, the fire helicopters too. That could actually be good. Got the warehouses. Man, we got a lot of stuff now. A lot, a lot of stuff. That's great. Okay, we also have a lot of... Um, oh, sorry. Wait. Oh, do we not have enough water? Wait, do we? Hang on. I'm confused. We might not. It's kind of hard to tell. I think we don't have enough water. So how are we getting water? Just... No, that's a inland water treatment. Oh, I think we're just using water towers, aren't we? Do we have the big water... Oh, we still don't have the big water tower. Yeah, because we've got two water towers, I think, is how we're getting all of our water. <laughs> all right, I'm going to get another one over here. Sure, that'll do. There you go. So that should be enough water. Let's see. Let that sort of fill up. 
There you go. Great. Okie dokie. Let's get um, back over here where I was. I feel like this part, this um, park, this park project is coming along really well. That's kind of a weird path. I don't know why I did that. Um, can I like connect any of these? Not really. How do I want to do this? Does I guess from the end of this road, it should just go there. I don't know. <laughs> it's kind of weird. And from here, we can come up, join to the end of this road. And I also feel like from the end of this road, it should go this way to join to that road. So this sort of connects, you know, nicely through to all this stuff. I th I'm going to, uh oh, I'm having sewage problems. <laughs> oh boy. All right, we do need some more sewage treatment, maybe. Oh, we got a sewage treatment plant here. Maybe we need a, maybe we should do it like, over let's do it over here. Let's do it like a little sewage treatment area too. I like having these little areas, you know, just cut compartmentalizing. I'm going to get one here. I actually want them to be a little varied, so I'm going to do... Hang on. One that goes sideways, too. We only really need two at the moment, I think, but I think what I'll do... I'll go three. That one kind of overlaps a little bit, but that's fine. We'll get, like, a little water treatment section there. I'm going to get rid of this one. And then these will be out here. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah! That's good. I'm just gonna get straight road down. Actually, you know what? No, not straight road. This will go, you know, come along here, along this little water area. To there. And again, I'm not gonna have any crossing here because it kind of looks a little silly, to be honest, in the middle of nowhere. Just do that, and then this just gives away. Oh, and I should probably actually connect it. <laughs> yeah, I should probably actually connect it to stuff too. That would probably be useful. Maybe down the road. Maybe we should have one coming down this way too, just for aesthetical reasons. I don't know. All right, then the pipes just get all connect as well. Down this road. And I think we've made some good progress. I feel like this road is probably suffering a little bit now too. Anyway, so that goes there. That should hopefully fix that. Now let me just get a Okay, back to getting the houses in, because that's what I was doing. Got some houses here. Oh, this is like perfect commercial space right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not there though. Just just there. That's good. Very nice. I like this. I like this. I'm gonna check that bus those bus lines that we did as well in a little second. I don't know what's going on. Some of the zoning is a bit funky, but whatever. <laughs> it, it is what it is. Not sure what I want to do around here. I might do a few more shots because it's around the school, but we'll see. So I'm just leaving that for now. Oh yeah, I guess we have all this, which I haven't actually done. This, I kind of just want it to be residential as well. Like, nothing fancy through here. That probably should be a pathway right there. Yeah, nice. So just fill out that area. Today I, I didn't pipe it. Piping! There we go, and then... There. Cool. All right. So that sort of expands us all down there. I love, I do, I do really love this sort of waterfront road. I think this is cool. I think this is very, very cool. Let's have a look before we end up today. Uh, the buses, how we go, oh, they're already kind of missing a whole section of the city. Anyway, let's check out this yellow line. How's this going? Line details, 30 out of 30, 12 out of 30, 25, 2, 18. Maybe we have one too many buses. We could probably do with one less bus, to be honest. Because there's a couple that aren't that full. Although it's probably a good amount. I think the yellow line's doing well. The blue line, last, oh my God, these buses are crazy. Last we saw it was actually really busy. Uh, 63, 73, 50, 11 on that one. 34, 72. You know what? I think this is actually working really well. We don't have hundreds of people waiting anymore. Some of the buses aren't as full, but I think that's good. Like it seems like we've got a good amount there. <sighs> Yeah, this is coming along. So we've got, do we have any, we have one district there that kind of is a bit weird because it doesn't even uh, go all the way down here. So I think maybe I'll extend this district along this edge up to here. And this will be all this sort of first district we had. And this is a new district. I don't know what it's going to be. Let's find out. 
going to be something probably crazy and wild. Really excitingly named. Beechwood Hills. What's with the hills? It's literally flat. <laughs> I feel like they really don't take into account the actual topography when they name these things. <laughs> Alright, well, we got apparently Beechwood Hills over here. Beechwood... Hang on. Beechwood Flats. There you go. <laughs> Stupid name. Ah, yeah, this is looking good. I, I really like... Let's get... Let's really get... Let's get in here. Uh, which button am I using? This one? Yeah, there we go. Oh, yeah. I like the, I like this pathway. I think we could... Oh, okay. Well, I gotta, I gotta fix up some of this, but... So I think we could, um, have some really cool stuff going on down here. So people down on the pier. Like, this whole area along the waterfront. I think it's awesome. I think that's really cool. And this bridge... Not the best looking bridge. Look. I'll be the first to admit, doesn't look great, but it, it's kind of like a placeholder. Like, it will go over there and it'll go somewhere, you know, whatever. But we have this sort of main road here, and I really like that. And I guess that's just going to continue down here somewhere. I don't know, down here, down along this beach, maybe do a bridge here. The highway's over there, so maybe we just connect through. I don't know. I don't know, but I think... That's good. So make sure to leave your comment suggestions and feedback down below. Any mods you think I should still have. Any of that stuff. Here's our little commercial district from last time as well. Like our city's really coming alive now, you know? This main road's... It's still not that busy. But I guess because it's kind of a main road that really doesn't go anywhere. Like if we're, if we're being real about it, this main road sort of comes down here, goes to here, that doesn't go anywhere. And it goes along here. And this road doesn't go anywhere yet. But I think in time, it's going to make a lot more sense. Especially when we build over here. Because then we'd probably have people coming from the highway down this road to get over here. And oh, actually it looks like there is another highway connection over here too anyway. So if we connected that up, that would sort of be probably the main thoroughfare. But yeah, at the moment, I guess it doesn't really go anywhere. So not a lot of people are going on that road. I mean, there's still some. But we definitely have more people sort of traveling in between. Which makes sense. It's the way we've sort of designed it. And try to spread out most things. I guess except the only thing we haven't spread out is the industrial. Oh yeah, look at this sweet little recycling area. It is disgusting, mind you. It's already hazy with pollution and the grass is already purple. <laughs> but it's that little recycle plant. I quite like that. I feel like we need a little toll booth entrance, you know. And then we've got a sweet ore industry there. We're doing some mining. Very nice. Little water treatment plant, which also looks disgusting. Which, I mean, I guess it is. <laughs> right on the river here. Very nice. And then, oh, look at it. I like this area out here. I like these train bridges, too. We should... Oh, wait, do we have... We don't have trains yet, do we? I don't think so. That's later. Yeah, it's a little late. It's funny how you don't have trains yet, but we could build an airport. <laughs> like, we don't have the vanilla, like, original airports yet, but we have the huge brand new ones. All right. Anyway, I'm going to leave this part here. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time. And have an awesome day.